Okay, let's get back to Final Fantasy Advance Tastics. Or Final Fantasy Tastics Advance. Sorry. And we're going to start by moving our black mange up here. Um, it's early morning here. And then we're going to use thunder on this guy. Get ready to feel the thunder! Sorry, I seen Kung Fu Panda yesterday. That movie was the stuff. Seen it with my dad. And now he's gonna move somewhere. Yeah, you know, I hate how archers are like so useless in the beginning of the game. They always miss. Just like that. That's why I don't have one. I'm gonna get mines later on. And the thief is still asleep. I didn't expect him to be asleep like this long. I thought he was gonna wake up like on the second turn. But you know what? This is good. Now I can go after that white mage. But I think I'm gonna heal Marsh. First aid. Doesn't really do much, but I mean, it's better to have little damage and it'll get us a little bit of experience. I never got why they got experience on here in the first place. Oh crap, speak of the devil. Yeah, like I said, I never got why they um have experience on here because, I mean, it all depends on what kind of moves you learn. Because. On my game for Game Boy Advance, uh, I had uh, one of my clan mates were only at like level 14, while the rest of my people were like at 30 maybe, and we were going against a clan that was like at level 20. I taught him Holy Sword. Uh, what else? Gave him Double Sword, and taught him a whole bunch of sweet paladin moves and he was up there with all the other people fighting against them he wasn't dying all because he knew very sweet moves so I don't really see the point of leveling up on here but you know what I think leveling up it does something to like different clans that you encounter in the missions or no that's what you do with clan missions I'm gonna explain that later because after this match, like, the whole game pretty much starts. You can start doing link battles and uh, start fighting enemy clans outside of here. But, you know, uh, you, you'll see all that later. Uh, I don't know why. I just healed both of them. I don't think they were both hurt. But, you know, just to be safe. So let's kill this guy. See, he has counter now. And hopefully he'll miss. Dang it. Oh, well. Alright, where should I move him? So I'm really relaxed right now. It's like 10. I'm gonna have him try to kill the the thief from far away. No, you know what? Never mind. I can't use fire because the law says so. Freaking laws. And whatever thunder attack I do down there will hurt all my people. So I'm just gonna hit this guy. Pikachu! Bitch! <laughs> Alright. Get them judge points. Now, this guy's got a lot of judge points. I think that's like six. No, that's only five. Ah, oh, crap. Now he's starting to go after the thief. He's gonna kill him. He just said it was gonna take 24. I hate it when they do that. Alright, all I gotta do is kill the white man. Hopefully his turn isn't right after I hit him. And inconveniently, it probably is. Asshole. Good, it took 23. Maybe that hit ratio thing is kinda good on one side and bad on the other. Oh well. You move, your little judge. Now it's his turn. As I said. And he's stupid enough to go and hit somebody. I mean... Like, I'd just run if I was you and heal myself and just keep running. I never knew how to banish units off the map. And I think I'm gonna put somebody to sleep. You know what? No, he can't reach. And I'm not gonna attempt it either. I'm finna just go after this white mage. Ah. Really enjoying this game. I'm gonna start training off screen. So, like, all my people can, like, have expert jobs and know a lot of moves. And you guys can, like, watch one day. All uh, like, oh my god, how did he learn all the moves? Because I fight other people and do other missions. So, ah, oh, crap, I can't 
I can't get close to the enemy unit. His dead body's blocking the way. Oh well. Let's just wait. And let's have her heal him. Hopefully he doesn't go after Theo. That's a cute name. I should name my daughter that. Theo. Yeah, that's a horrible name. It sounds like a name for a cat. Well, anyway, starting with this video, I'm going to start having MVP units. Or MVP awards at the end of every video. I think I said that last time. And we both missed each other. And let's have him use Blizzard on this guy. Ah, oh, crap. Gotta move on a little bit. Let's move to the left. Okay. Blizzard. Get ready to feel the chill. That really didn't sound like ice noise. Oh, well. Now he gets judge points. Good stuff there. I don't know what the black mage's name. But who cares? And like I suspected, he's going after the white mage. But is he gonna hit her? Nope! See, this is why I made her the white mage. Because I know she couldn't do squat. I mean, nobody could do squat to her. I'm a tactical genius. Matter of fact, none of my units died. I just made the first mission look like a cakewalk. Well, that's what it says in the strategy guides. It's all like cakewalk for the first couple of missions. Normally, I like have at least three people dead on this mission. But you know what? Gosh, maybe I am a good tactician or good at tactics. Whatever. We just won. Same here, Marsh. Same here. I'm getting the hang of this too. My ass. Whoo! That was fun. And now oh, it's an after mission cutscene, and he's looking at a piece of paper. I didn't even know they had this kind of animation. Oh well. Ugh. Now they're talking. Oh, I do voiceovers, but my nose really hurts. Mm. And now they're talking about the clan wars, which is how we're going to start training, by fighting enemy clans in the middle of nowhere. And we're going to kill them, and it's going to be fun. I don't know why, but killing people is just fun, especially in Grand Theft Auto. I mugged a guy, stabbed him a couple of times, shot him again, and if I could, I would take a dookie on him. Yeah, but I think that's too much information. But it's fun, though. Oh, thank God, it's finally over. And now clan is added to the menu. And we just want... Oh, God, we got a lot of money. Let's put Luna... Or no, Nubs Woods right here. And Cyril Shake. Shook. Let's go there. Oh, cutscene. Hey, Mr. Pub Guy, I didn't know you had some importance to this game. Like, I seriously forgot about this cutscene. Busy with the clan wars. They should have just called this Final Fantasy Tastics Clan Wars. I think that like get a whole more people buying this game. Oh well. I think I'm gonna stop it for ten minutes so I can put in that MVP thing now. So it's got, probably gonna stop starting that. I don't know. Forget it. I'm out. Matter of fact, let's just go back to the pub and spawn. Yep. Look at the rumors. Well, leave me a five star rating. Get ready to watch the uh, MVP awards. And, um, what else? Oh, yeah, leave comments if you like. Add me as a friend. Do whatever you want. Just, like, give me a view. That's all I'm asking for. Good night. And our MVP award goes to Dominic, our black mage. Who's a novel? He got us six judge points in one bout. Thank God for that. And because of his performance, I'm going to make him a sage now. So, expect to see him a sage in the next video.
Good night.